Matthew, thank you. Michigan apple orchards are experiencing huge losses across the state after a devastating spring frost, and it's causing apple prices in Michigan to go up. It's also changing the way one orchard is doing business. TV5's James Felton talked with a local orchard owner to share his apple harvest experience this year. We experienced uh, probably at least a 60% drop in what we would say would be an average crop. Spring weather did a number on John Lehman's apple crop. An early warm up brought out apple blossoms, many of which died during a late freeze. Lehman, who co-owns Lehman's Green Apple Barn, tells us the problems didn't stop once the mercury started to rebound. We still had temperatures in the 50s and in the high 40s. Uh, honeybees don't like cold weather and so we think part of it might have been um, uh, the bees staying in to keep warm and not being out there to uh, pollinate. Fewer apples means higher prices. And with the reduced amount of apples, customers won't be able to get their own apples off the tree this year. With the lack of apples on those trees that we usually offer to you pickers, that the, just wasn't something we could make available. And despite the apple shortage, Lehman tells me many varieties of apples will be available later in the fall. There's some excellent apples coming uh, later in October. Lehman is quick to point out there are still plenty of reasons to stop by and spend some time at his farm. We'd like to encourage people to visit their local orchards and, and have a taste of uh, locally made cider and and uh, get the apples that are available and just come and have a good time. Reporting in Saginaw County, James Felton, WNEM TV5.